Hi friends, welcome back. Hearty welcome to you. In this session, let's look at how to find the image of a particular point with respect to a specific line mirror. So, this is nothing but extension of whatever we have learned in the last session. That is, how to find out the coordinates of a foot of the perpendicular drawn from a particular point to a line. So let's first try to plot the straight line under the point and see how we have to proceed forward. So the line is 5x minus 7y equal to 1. If x equal to 0, that will give me y equal to minus 1 by 7. If y equal to 0, that will give me x equal to 1 by 5. So, the straight line is given by two values, 1 by 5 comma 0, 0 comma minus 1 by 7, 0 comma minus 1 by 7 somewhere here and uh, 1 by 5 comma 0 also somewhere there only ok so that's a straight line we have so let's try to draw this line that's a line we are talking about that's our mirror line so this is line five x minus seven y equal to one. Now what we have to find out? We have to find out image of the point with respect to this line. So this line is like a mirror. We have drawn a perpendicular from a particular point. We want to find out on the opposite side what are the coordinates which is the image of this particular point with respect to the mirror. Now where is the point 8 comma minus 5? So let us say 8 8 comma minus 5. So let's say the point is here 8 comma minus 5 Let that point be 8 comma minus 5 so we want to find out the image. What I should do first? I should drop a perpendicular. Drop a perpendicular from that point to the line and extend it. If you extend it, then the foot of the perpendicular will be the midpoint of the point and its image. This point has to be very clear. Once you are able to understand that, then it is pretty simple. So what we have been given? We have been given a straight line 5x minus 7y equal to 1. We have been already also given a point 8 comma minus 5. We have to find out the image of this point 8 comma minus 5 with respect to the line 5x minus 7y equal to 1. So the point what we have to understand is the given point and its image the midpoint of them will be nothing but point of intersection of the perpendicular on the line 5x minus 7y equal to 1. So let us say this is L and let us say this is m. Now, equation of, let us say this point is x and let us say this is a and this is b. Okay. Now, first we have to find out the equation of a, b. Then only I can find out the coordinates of x. So, first let us go for equation of a, b. For equation of AB, I know it will be perpendicular to 5x minus 7y equal to 1. So can I say 7x plus 5y equal to k and it also has to pass through the point 8 comma minus 5. 
So if I substitute, I will have 56 7 into 8 minus 5 into 5 25 equal to k or 7x plus 5y minus 31 equal to 0. So this is the equation of the line AB. Okay. Now once we got the equation of the line AB, we also know the equation of L. We can easily find out the point of intersection X. For that what we will do? We will find out the point of intersection. We will take two straight line equations. The first one is 5x minus 7y minus 1 equal to 0. The second one is 7x plus 5y minus 31 equal to 0. What I will do now? I want to cancel y terms. So I will multiply the first one with 5 first equation and the second equation with 7. If I do that, I will have 5 into first will give me 25x minus 35y minus 5 equal to 0 and if I multiply with 7, I will have this is x, I will have 49x plus 35y minus 7 into 31 is 217. So, if I simplify it further, just simply add them, y will cancel out. I will have 74x minus 222 equal to 0. That will give me x equal to 3. If I substitute x equal to 3, I will get y equal to 2. So, we know the coordinates of x now, that is nothing but equal to 3 comma 2. We know that coordinates of x is 3 comma 2. How we found it? Just point of intersection by elimination method. Okay. Now, what we know in, I am taking here A, B and the point x. We know that the coordinates of A is 8 comma minus 5. X coordinates just now we found it to be 3 comma 2. We have to find out B coordinates. Let us say they are nothing but X1 comma Y1. Now we know that AX is equal to XB or X is midpoint of AB. So, whenever we have been asked to find the image, one way to solve them is find out the foot of perpendicular like how we have done earlier. Then we know that the other point you can easily find out as you know that X is the midpoint of AB. Now, now let us try to find out the midpoint of AB. What it will be? X1 plus 8 by 2, but that is nothing but equal to, we know, 3. Similarly, can I find out the midpoint of y coordinate, that is y1, this is x1, let us say this is y1, I'll just erase this, we have y1, minus 5 by 2 equal to 2. Now, if you simplify this, you will get x1 equal to 6 minus 8 minus 2, y1 equal to 4 plus 5, 9. So, the coordinates of this particular point is minus 2 comma 9. So, I have to go little bit more up to here that is where I have the point minus 2 comma 9. These are coordinates of the image that is minus 2 comma 9. So, that is how we can find out the image of a point with respect to the line mirror. So, what are the steps we have to follow before summarizing? 
the first step is find the equation of the perpendicular to the line so we can do that very easily because we know the slope of the line perpendicular is nothing but reciprocal and multiple of negative 1 then we know the point from which the perpendicular is drawn so I know the equation of AB I know the equation of L I can find out foot of perpendicular that's nothing but point of intersection of those two lines once I got the foot of the perpendicular I know the image will be at the same distance how much it is from the line that means it will be perpendicular and also it will be at the same distance so I know coordinates of A if I know coordinates of X I can easily find out coordinates of B by using the midpoint formula that AX and XB are equal and X divides AB in the ratio 1 is to 1 so X1 plus 8 by 2 is 3 and Y1 minus 5 by 2 equal to 2 so the coordinates of the image of the point 8 comma minus 5 with respect to the line mirror 5x minus 7y equal to 1 is minus 2 comma 9 so to summarize three steps to solve these problems first find out the equation of the perpendicular second find out the point of intersection third leverage the midpoint formula and find out the coordinates of B because we know in mirror the reflection is always at the same distance so AX is equal to XB so in the next session we will look into another interesting concept and example thanks for visiting bye for now